you guys see what I'm seeing? Do you, do you see what I'm seeing here? Roscoe says, I'm seeing Roscoe Milk sees what's up. That's all that matters is Roscoe sees what's up. Someone sent in an entire mid Alica. That's right, it's mid Alica. One of the worst bands of all time. Oh my God. Oh, I'm so, ah, this is gonna be so good. Oh my God, I'm so excited. You have no idea. I love Master of Puppets. It is so good. It is so transcendental. It goes so above and beyond. Even the metal, th like the thrash metal casings it's a part of, as it just feels like an immersive, unbelievably dense and dark experience. It's like so good. Even Returns, who's like, you know, it's one of the few albums that's like highly praised that actually lives up to the hype. I completely agree. It's universally good. Like, it's just so good. And now we got Ride the Lightning. I think I've heard two or three tracks from this album, and I really liked it a lot. And it's a totally different feeling. It's a totally different style and sound. But here's the other thing. I actually listened to the debut recently. Like, like I know what they got before, too. So I'm so excited to see the progression. Because, again, I've, I've heard some tracks off of here, but not the whole thing. Kill Them All, that's what it was. Yeah, Kill Them All. So I've heard Kill Them All. I think I would give that album... Oh, man, that's a good album. The mix is terrible. Can we all universally agree the mix on that album is, like, laughably bad? Like, it's actually so bad, that. but but at the same time, I didn't really care too much. It's, like, 8-plus, probably, for me. Oh, the mix on that album is ass. <laughs> it's so bad. <laughs> Bro, what's the... Oh. Even remastered, bro. You hear that drum, though? I mean, again, I love the album. I don't really have much of a problem with it, but I, I think that anyone who says that, like, it's it's a well-mixed album, the original, nah. It generally inspired me as someone who's struggling very badly with mental health and feeling loved. Oh, wow, thank you. I'm glad you feel uh, comforted in this community. That's all I could ask for. I'm so excited. Oh, Ride the Lightning. 1984. 47 minutes. Let's fucking go, dude. This, this is about to just be ascension. Fight with the fire. Fight with the fire. Fuck all you hoes! Detroit till I die, motherfucker! Literally 1984. Talking all that bullshit! No, I'm not listening to this full album. I've heard, like, songs here and there, though. I know, this isn't metal. We've been, we've been trapped. We've been tricked. There it is. Oh my god. Oh. That's cool, motherfucking boy! Oh my god, it's so hard, dude. It's like the previous album, but like, well mixed. Dude, it's like, they're just flexing. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my goodness, this beat is so hard. Fun is a good way to put it. I ex hates Metallica and anything that's heavier than Christina Aguilera, that's why I broke up with her. Red Sus, we all know you've never actually been with a partner before. Ooh! How do you request the full album? Have a lot of money in your bank account. And then send in the best shit ever, like this. We fire, we fire, we fire. She fired my Oh! Oh yeah, oh. Oh, and it- Oh, the trans- Oh my god, the transition. Now, I don't know about you, but, uh... Does anybody see any problems with that song? I'm, I'm looking. I'm, I'm like, does anyone see any problems with that song? Because I certainly don't. I'm feeling... Okay. Hey, 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 hey. <laughs> 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 Kind of gangster. Oh my! Oh my God! <laughs> it's so good. So much fun, lover. Hey! 
fuck you then, I'll fuck you straight. <laughs> Thanksgiving, I ain't thankful. I'm gonna take it. Oh my god. So oh, these guys are like gods in human form. At the guitar. That was a gaslighting stream. It was the hardest thing I've ever watched, but the victim showed up. Pretty lit. Oh my god. Oh yeah, I gotta pause because the stream is gonna get deleted. Alright, I'm done pausing. Die. Yeah. No, I'm not listening to Sound McFall. I think I've heard this song before, but I don't remember it that much. Dude, it's so good. This is a good Metallica album. So far, I gotta say, I, I mean, I can't jump to conclusions, but like, this shit pretty good. Oh, that was a good ass song. With well, that being said, even though I love this track and I think it has a lot of multifaceted elements to it, it's a 9 plus, not a 10. I think there was a little bit in the beginning where I was kind of like uh, not as engaged. Uh, maybe it had to do with the lyrics, but this one definitely is the more ambitious full package. I think it was fucking amazing though. Damn, that shit really took you on a wild, a wild ride with the lightning. It left a big impression too at the end of it. Uh, so yeah, I was, uh, I was pretty lit. Just the same. I know it's just the same as the last song. They're really running out of ideas here, huh? No. Yeah. Next song from Whom the Bell Tolls. I know I've heard this one. God, oh my god, guys, it's the Daft Punk song. Thanks to Brazil! Okay. Okay. Well, the shit goes hard in the club. Yo, Ram Ranch? Ram Ranch reference? 18 naked cowboys in the showers at Ram Ranch? Oh, no, Pac-Man. Drugs are bad. Oh, that's PTSD right there. Oh, shit. Pretty good. All right. Naked and 18 music, 18 naked music critics in a hot tub. So it's awesome on the radio whether this is Hell's Bells by HCDC. It's usually the latter, yeah. Oh, I get what you're saying. Like when the song starts. Fuck all you hoes! Detroit till I die, motherfucker! From whom the bell tolls, bells tolls, toll bells. I don't know, I ain't gonna lie, that one was, uh, was, was pretty good. I'm feeling. <laughs> From who the tell bulls? Men flushing their guns and bulls. Women looking like Barbie dolls. The riffs are unbelievable. It's full of creativity. I love the lyrics on this one. I feel like it's just perfect. Fade to black. Yo, ACDC? Fade to black? Fade to black! I'm sick! Ain't nobody gonna tell me how to live. Oh yeah, didn't Six Feet Under do a cover of this? They don't make them like this anymore. Metallica's pretty easy to hear what they're saying. You just gotta pay attention. Emo as fuck. Are you ready? I mean, this shit is amazing so far. I've been spoiling it. Wait, oh, I recognize this. Oh, that's so good! 
Oh my god! That is like the best riff ever. What the fuck? That is so good. Yeah, that riff is absolutely incredible. This is the band that made we that it had Weezer make one of the covers of their songs. Yeah. Of course it fades to black. Why wouldn't it? It makes perfect sense. I mean, I thought that song was okay. I mean, I don't know. I'm not fooling anybody. I'm feeling. <laughs> I mean, that was absolutely unbelievable. I mean, what the f? <laughs> Yo, that was pretty good. I, I can't lie. That was pretty good. Oh, my God. Oh, man. Oh, everything about that from the dark, horrifying lyrics. To literally, what the fuck? That riff is so classic. But not only is it classic, but like it it holds up. It's so good. It's so good. <laughs> Next song, Trapped Under Ice. Fuck all you hoes. Detroit till I die, motherfucker. <laughs> You know why be freezing? Young men will be freezing. If you land the seas, I'll have you eat the rest of the trees. Hey! Bitch, I got that Gucci. Hey! And I rock that Louis. Trapped Under Ice is great. It's not my favorite of the album, but I think it's really well done regardless. I think it starts off with one of the best riffs of the album. Um, but it just kind of runs through emotions, as a lot of these other tracks do. I like the lyrics a lot, though, as they seem to be just, again, referring, if I had to guess, to depression and feeling really trapped under ice like you can't get out, which is just a horrifying sight. Uh, I think the song's great, but, yeah, it's just still not one of my favorites. It's like an eight, uh, like an eight, solid eight for me, I think. Next song, Escape. Everyone says it's the worst song. I don't, I don't know. It just sounds pretty damn good so far. Pretty gangsta. I'm gonna fucking spank. I got the crack up in my sack. I got the crack up in my crack up. DJ Kevin! This one is like good Motley Crue. I mean, I kind of agree. This one is sort of unextraordinary. I don't hate it. It's just not as good as the others. Escape the fate. I agree with everyone else. It's weak. Uh, it's one of the weaker tracks for me. I, I'm not super in love with it. It's still a smiley ball for me. I enjoy it while it's on, but I just don't think that it kind of stands up. Even in the last one, just all right, you know. It's okay. Again, I don't hate it. Metallica strikes again. Yeah, I think we should invalidate everything because because uh, of that song. Kind of hard to have some weak shit. Shout out to my dogs. I'm talking about some meek shit. Next song, creeping death. This one sounds a little familiar. There we go. Fuck all you hoes! Detroit till I die, motherfucker! Hell yeah, Kid Rock. Oh my god. Oh yeah, look at this. This one seems very literal. Let's talk about that. Jews! My riff is nutty. Do it again! I'll be a gang boy! I'll be a gang boy! That sounds like the same the arch slur. Freaking dead. Yeah, Metallica are one of those bands that I, I've never actually called overrated. Yeah, 
prayer that there's a song like this where I actually understand the biblical uh, the biblical implications of what's going on because I actually know the story. Gotta say, I'm feeling. I think this last song is an instrumental, if I remember correctly, which I did enjoy a lot. Man, that song was good. Man, that song was pretty good. I ain't gonna lie, this shit pretty good. Definitely worth the hype. It's a lot of killing, no filler, you know? Besides escape. Ain't nobody gonna tell me how to live. Certified David mustache moment. Okay. Why are there no lyrics for this one? I must try away again Through the storm, through the wind I'm a weak human after all <laughs> Oh, the building of intensity, bro. This is shit. Oh, it's so full. Loaded Diaper really stepped up the game. I ain't read the contract, ain't read the code. Yeah. Put a bitch, take off your clothes. Yeah. Oh my god. Oh. Pretty good. That's pretty good. Huh? Ah! You're so good. Smile the ball. Damn. I'm feeling. Overall, this album, yeah, I'm feeling a solid nine. Oh man, oh it's so good. It took it took me to a new world, a different world in the middle of my stream, which is so good. Oh, it's so beautiful. It's albums like these that make it kind of difficult to get back into the queue because it's like so immersive. It's so extraordinary. It's such a mind-altering listen. Like the the playing is so bizarre and so above and beyond. Oh, I love it. Yeah, no, I mean this this is amazing. No, I think that this is like pretty much as good of an album as Master of Puppets. I think, but it's like I, I prefer Master, but this is this is pretty unbelievable. Like this, this is absolutely unbelievable. You know, and it shouldn't take away from the fact that like this is just so good. It's literally so good. Oh God, please save me. Why is that stuck in my head? I don't 